the Duke and Duchess of Sussex sent a thank you card to the royal well wisher who had written to the pair congratulating them on Meghan's pregnancy. The fan shared a picture of Harry and Meghan's card on Instagram, revealing the adorable snap on the front. The cute photo shows the couple, who are known for their public displays of affection, during their overseas tour last October. In the picture, doting Meghan is holding an umbrella over Harry after the heavens opened as he delivered a speech in Dubbo, Australia. Meghan is looking at Harry lovingly, and they are both smiling despite the pouring rain. The message inside the card read, The Duke and Duchess of Sussex were touched by your very kind message following the happy news that they are expecting their first child. It really was most thoughtful of you to write as you did, and their royal highnesses send you their warmest thanks and best wishes. The Instagram post has prompted a delighted response from other royal followers, gathering over 100 likes since it was posted last week. The royal fan wrote, Thank you card from TRH the Duke and Duchess of Sussex thanking me for sending my congratulations to them on the announcement that the Duchess is pregnant. Meghan's pregnancy was announced as she set off on her 16-day Commonwealth tour with Harry. The mother-to-be showed off the first glimpses of her baby bump as she and Harry visited Australia, New Zealand, Fiji, and Tonga. Last month, the 37-year-old let slip she is due to give birth at the end of April or early May. Kensington Palace had only previously said the royal tot was due in the spring. Meghan and Harry are moving to Frogmore Cottage in Windsor ahead of the birth of their baby. Their new house is currently undergoing renovations before the pair move in. And speculation is high over where Meghan will give birth to her and Harry's firstborn. It was claimed, that the US-born former actress would have her baby at Frimley Park Hospital in Surrey. Meghan was said to be shunning the exclusive Lindo wing at St Mary's Hospital, where the Duchess of Cambridge gave birth to her three children because she doesn't want to do anything that Kate Middleton has. But more recently a royal source revealed staff at the private maternity unit favored by Kate have been asked not to take holiday in April, suggesting Meghan could be due to give birth there. 